Hey, welcome to Paddle and Hike. Today we're in Sutton, Quebec, and we're gonna hike the Round Top, but the bigger loop, the one that goes with Dutch Summit and Mount Gagnon. So it's a longer trail and you pass by many point of views and lakes. Let's go. I came here around 15 years ago to do the basic round top, but I never did the full loop that I'm gonna do today. So that's gonna be pretty interesting, pretty cool. As per what I've seen on the map, there's a lot of point of views, a lot of things to see, and it should be a nice day. It's a bit cold. It's around 10 degrees Celsius, but you know, winter's coming. You have to reserve for your parking space, so you have to go online. I'll put the website in the description so you can reserve your place. And there's an entry fee. At the moment, it's $8 for an adult, but it might change. So we're in fall, so all the colors are coming out. Still not in the trees, but at least on the ground. Winter will be there very soon. It's already there in the high peaks. This mountain is not super high, so there won't be any snow here, but still. So it's pretty easy all the way up to around maybe a kilometers before the Dutch summit then it starts to be a bit more steep because you start to climb. And then you reach the first view, which is actually a couple of views. You have like three view there. On my way here, I was eating the donut and the cookies that I made in the last videos. The keto cookies and donuts. Oh my God, they're so good. Make sure to check it out if you didn't already. You don't need to be keto or low carbs. They are super good. I'll put the link up there if you want to see it. This trail is pretty popular, so prepare yourself to have people around. There's gonna be other hikers. If it's the weekend, it must be super crowded. And even during the week, you might have some people like today. Don't be fooled by the map when you arrive near Mount Gagnon. This is not the view. There's a little pad that you can see on like Gaia and whatever. This goes to nowhere. It's a bushwhack kind of trail and it leads nowhere. Just keep on going, maybe like five to 10 minutes later, you'll see a point of view. Make sure to smash that like button.
So to recap everything here, it's an easy to moderate trail. I would say the only part that I would say it's moderate to a bit harder is the round up, which is the most rewarding part because you have a lot of stairs and you have a section with a rope. Other than that, it's super easy. It's a family hike. There's many options. You can do shorter trails. You can do loops. If you do the two biggest ones are the ridge and the one that I just did. But other than that, you have like five kilometers, six kilometers trails. So it can be really easy for kids or family. It's not an issue. If you want to do the round top, there's a trail just to go to the round top. And if you want to do the loops, well, you can. You'll have a bunch of views, like a bunch. Are they all good? No. Some are worth it, some are not. You get to see the mud pond, which has like a old historical dam. And you also get to see two lakes, Vogel and Sprouse. Um, beautiful lake and uh, plenty of fish in it. <laughs> and you get the main top, which is the round top with the two views that are beautiful, beats all the other ones. But yeah, it resumes pretty much everything here. It's a nice hike. It's just very, very muddy at the moment, like crazy muddy. So I hope you enjoyed that video. See you soon.